Welcome to Enchanted Tarot. This is for the sign of Capricorn. It is a general reading. That being said, it may or may not resonate with you. If it doesn't sound like it's your story, check your other placements. Your messages could be there. So Capricorn, I feel like you could be um, missing information to be able to paint or finish painting your uh, vision for the future. Because you have the painter here which is about creation and vision focus and where your focus is um, you can be it can indicate that you can be trying to develop a vision for the future okay for solutions for change even um, there could be something that you really want to change because you feel you need to. It can also indicate that there's something uh, that is really annoying you and frustrating you that you feel you need to change. Okay. And, um, and that is this. It comes with this dog. Okay. And so this is about loyalties and faithfulness. So I feel like you need to know where somebody's loyalty is or where someone's faithfulness is uh, in order for you to complete this, uh, this vision you are trying to create. Okay, now it comes with the ring. So we are talking about uh, a commitment that you uh, greatly value. You know, I mean, it, it could also be um, someone, this could be indicating someone that you uh, wish to create a vision, a long term uh, vision, you know, with this person. But you need to know if they are loyal to you, if they are faithful to you. You may feel, you may have your suspicions that this person may have snuck around. Here it is. May have cheated on you. And you want to get to the root of that. You need you need to clear that up so you can uh, decide how to paint your picture for the future you know and uh, so uh, the ring can also indicate things coming back around so I mean this could be something that's happened current happening currently or with your person uh, someone you've been dating or this could be someone who is uh, coming back or who has come back and this person maybe has cheated on you uh, in the past um, and and now you're wondering if uh, maybe they still are seeing that person possibly. So there is a commitment that is in question and the future of that commitment and how you're going to paint uh, or fill in your painting. Okay, maybe they're hiding something like you're missing details. Um, there's the moon so you may feel that things are hidden from you but these this could be subconscious fears also um but i i feel like you really have a strong feeling okay and um i think that you want you want to change things like you're feeling insecure here you want to be able to paint your picture for the future with you and your and your 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 love interest, uh, a, a future of you two, you know, moving happily forward, building your future together. But there's this little thing here that's causing you to hesitate on whether or not that is actually the picture you'll be able to create, you know. Um, you don't want to fight, you just want to get to the truth. Um, you have a connection with this person, a very strong connection, uh, but uh, they have cheated on you before or, or you have been cheated on before and this is influencing your thoughts uh, and your perception of things with this person, okay, because, you know, it could go, uh, it could be ghosts from the past, it could go different ways. Um, depending on your situation. So here with the whip, uh, we see that there is uh, conflict. Um, 
The whip can be conflict uh, of any kind when it appears. Tensions are high in relationships. Communication struggles are at play. Um, it can be or point to a need uh, to regain control of a situation. If there's something in your life that you've been putting off because it's too painful or too hard, uh, the whip can be a reminder that you need to stop procrastinating and, you know, get it done. Because what I see right down here, you may be holding on to these feelings and really not letting the cat out of the bag, so to speak. So it's like you're you're not letting them know that you're suspicious of them. Okay, so you're not talking about it. So uh, emotionally, it's like you, you closed yourself up. And your heart is breaking. You may have come across a message of something uh, about or about some, yeah, you've come across some type of message that has caused you heartbreak, okay? Um, I, I feel like it's brought up old wounds, whether those wounds were created from that person or whether it was, uh, you know, uh, by somebody else. Yeah, see, you've been burned before. You're, you're like, okay, I've been burned before. I don't want that, you know, uh, to happen again. I need to be very, very careful. So here you are afraid of um, of uh, the unknown, of uh, unwelcome surprises. There's a third party here. Um, uh, competition here. Uh, when it comes to your... Uh, your new beginning, okay? You are uh, conflicted about a third party. You're conflicted about cheating. That's what it is. Uh, it's here and it's here, uh, okay? Uh, and it's here. And it's here. <laughs> You're questioning their faithfulness and their loyalty to you. So you'll know how to paint your picture for the future. That's what you're questioning. There you go. See, there's the hermit on the uh, on this uh, seven of wands. But here, this is about uh, a disagreement or cheating. Okay, uh, she looks like she's been hiding. That's that's it. That's what you were doing down here, hiding, just waiting for him to make a move. Okay, or show a sign of not being loyal to you or not being faithful to you. So that's why you're not letting the cat out of the bag. It's like you're spying almost on this person. I feel like this person does love you. And I feel like they want to build new memories with you uh, for the future. They want to be part of your painting, in effect. They want to, uh, they want to, uh, you know, create something with you. And you are going to hear about this. Um, if this was someone from your past, they will admit to having cheated in the past, but they are not cheating now. They are, they are guilty of a past, something happening in the past, but they are not guilty of uh, doing it now, okay? Um, so I feel like you may need to, if you want to move forward with this with this painting of you and this person, you will need to uh, try to forgive and let bygones be bygones if you want to move forward. Uh, otherwise, you know, you need to deal with these ghosts now and now is a good time to do that. That's what the whip is saying. Now is the time to and you know be uh, to 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 deal with these ghosts to talk about it even though it's very very hard and very very painful you're still feeling that's that's the thing the wound never healed and and so it, it's affecting you now in this relationship whether this person was the cheater or or whether it was someone else it, it's affecting your relationship and so um they are a good listener and they will listen. Uh, and if, if they have done something in the past, they will talk about it and own up to it. Uh, but they have not done anything here. Here they are being totally honest with you. Okay. They want, uh, they want to be with you. 
I feel like you will see a happy event in your future after after you have this talk there there looks like there is a celebration okay so you do have a new beginning with this person and you are going to get to fill in that painting the way you dreamt it would be but first you need to take care of these ghosts of the past so that is what I have for you. I thank you for watching, for liking, and for sharing my videos, and for subscribing. Also, thank you to everyone who has sent in a donation. It is greatly appreciated. Many blessings to all of you.